I'm here at one of the most impressive Pokemon card stores and warehouses in the world. Welcome to PokeCollect HQ. And we're here at the PokeCollect HQ with the one and only Trevor from PokeCollect. This is the shop. Yeah, man, this is it. This is PokeCollect. Okay, there is a lot to see here, including singles, including vintage. There's just kind of like something going on over there that's in other videos, including <laughs> so many amazing things. This is like a very proper Pokemon shop, warehouse, online thing. There's a stream room here. We're gonna check all of it out. Yeah, for sure. All right, let's see the grand tour. All right, man. Well, this is the store here. So we got kind of our display over here. Sorry, we've got some shipping supplies and everything. But we got our, you know, main display here. This is kind of where you like buy booster boxes and packs and stuff like that. Uh, we got our cash register here. We've got some singles displays. You know, you can kind of flip through here. We got some boxes that people can flip through for singles and things like that. Uh, but this is kind of the main attraction here. This is where most people kind of sit. You can see there's like alt arts and you know, nice Japanese cards, rainbows, gold, stuff oh like that. Oh my gosh, you have a moon, you have everything. Yeah, we got it all. <laughs> That's insane. Okay, if you watch the Las Vegas video, you know that whenever I go to a card shop, we go freaking hard. So there's a lot of things in singles in here. There's the Moon Brion over here, Aerodactyl the Alt Art, Lugia the Alt Art, some of my favorites, and the product shelf. There's a ton of things too. There's so much more inside of this shop that we're gonna show off and look at, but let's pick out some things first. Trevor, can I buy some things? So, can we do one box of V-Star and one box of 151. Yeah, absolutely, yep. Wait, and then out of the singles, let's go a little crazy. What's your favorite inside this entire case? Oh, Spoon Man. Everybody, yeah. Spoon Man? <laughs> if anyone knows me, it's Spoon Man. Oh, the Alakazam yeah, yeah, yeah. SAR. Yeah, okay, yeah. okay, let's do the Alakazam SAR. Oh, you're taking it? Yes. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> no, I was kidding, I was kidding. <laughs> okay, Alakazam SAR, actually the Charizard EX right next to it too. Mm -hmm. um, and then we'll do We'll do the, the row of the bottom right four. You got it. So you said that Moonbrion nice. comes and goes. Yeah, always, yeah. The Moonbrion is one of those things, I mean, it's just, it's a high enough price point where people always want to sell it, but there's always there's always a buyer for it too. Right. So it, it does come and go. So it's it's going. <laughs> oh, and then I, it's not a Pokemon card shopping spree without a waifu. Which waifu is your favorite? You know, I'm not the guy to ask, honestly. I'm probably the least, like, knowledgeable about that. Okay. Um, but if I had to pick one, uh, uh, let's go Serena? Serena? Yeah. Okay. We'll do the Serena. You didn't just pick the most expensive one, did you? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll do the Serena. I, might, I don't really know. <laughs> okay. Maybe, okay, sweet. Maybe. <laughs> so that's the first two cases and shelves. As you can see, there's a lot more in here. Take me around, man. All right. So this is kind of where all the magic happens. We've got some backstock here for like the storefront and all that kind of stuff. This is where kind of singles come in, things like that. Um, we got some working stations over here. So this is like for our e-commerce stuff. We got packing supplies. Oh wow! Here. Including oh, can I can I film this? Yeah, 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 absolutely. Oh my gosh! Including there are so many singles and something insane. A CGC Pristine Ten Sylveon Unigaba. Oh my oh, gosh! Just, just wait till we get to the studio. Oh, okay. just wait till we get to the studio. This yeah, guy's we got, crazy. We oh got, my gosh! This is like some some other stuff we got in the back here. So. Uh, this is like our slabs that we get in. Uh, we actually grade everything ourselves, so we send off every single one of these cards um, to get graded ourselves. So we look at all these, they come back and get graded. So we got them all organized back here. So oh, this, is cool too. this is like, like the, the Pokemon the... warehouse section we're about uh, to walk into right now. And as you can see behind me too, by the way, oh. thousands of singles. Oh. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, and this is definitely what they're known for here. Is there a Poke Collection? They have the Ultimate Collector Box. They've got the Mega Pack Bundle, the VIP Box, which is the best seller. So obviously, PokeCollect's link to their shop and store is down in the description below. Please check them out, get some stuff from their shop, and check out this kind of stuff, like their mystery product and their bundles. So good, chef's kiss. We'll open up some later in the video today. Oh, where are we going? All right, so this is the back storage room. So this is this is kind of the crazy part. It's like the warehouse. Yeah, this is just, you know, again, we do a lot of e-commerce, oh so. Oh my gosh. We got a few things. You know what's crazy is it's like soundproofed in here. Like all it's, this. It's pretty quiet. This is. It's pretty quiet. So these these just came in. Like this is the Charizard EX box. Oh. Every single one of these is one of these, which is a, oh it's a pretty sick God. box. It's a pretty sick box. Wait, can I buy one of those too? Yeah, absolutely. Nice. Okay. Yeah, thank that you. one's magic. I just. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, we're gonna hold you to that. <laughs> these are uh, these are the 151 UPCs. These just came in. Uh, pretty hot seller too. These guys right here. Yeah. Yep. So this, wow! Look at that. We even got our. That's so many. We got our name on it. <laughs> oh, that's cool. <laughs> this is wild. We got some back stock of like packs that we like break down. We got Evolving Skies and like Crown Zenith. 
Pokemon Go. We got all kinds of stuff. You have lots and lots of Crown Zenith. We got a lot of loose Crown Zenith. Very cool, brilliant stars. Yeah, we're just moving through all kinds of stuff like this. Wow, this is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> this is so much, like like there's literally, I could get lost in here. There's like <laughs> yeah, rows, rows and, and sh rows. This is crazy. It's a maze. It's amazing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, so what's your what is your favorite thing in here? Um, in the back storage room. Yeah. Obviously, I'll have to would choose from. Say, I don't know. I mean, I like I like some of the new stuff. So, this right here is kind of like some of they're not really older, but they're they're boxes that are you know you can't really get too much anymore. So this is you know we have like a bunch of Lost Origin and Silver Tempest and stuff like that. They're they're a little bit tougher to find, but this is kind of the booster box section here. Uh, we do have some of the newer boxes over here so this is uh obsidian flames oh we're like a couple days away from paradox rift too that's yeah. about to come in so we're gonna probably scoot all this stuff over like probably in the in the upper rafters here and then uh make room for some paradox rift that'll be sick okay let's go back to places where i can purchase things because i'm getting itchy right you're showing okay. me a lot of product <laughs> okay wait so right now what we're checking oh, out oh this is the studio here this is if you guys have seen you know anything on our YouTube channel? This is where the magic happens. This is the this is the YouTube studio going through some grading right here. This is beautiful. Yeah, we uh, we whipped it together, and um, you know we, we'll, we'll rotate some stuff in here. But yeah, this is the the YouTube background, the streaming background, whatnot background, all of that. It might look bigger on camera, but <laughs> we're actually streaming, but uh, it's actually pretty pretty cramped in here. Oh my gosh, and all these slabs over here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What this is in some the... recent returns. Whoa! Yeah. Oh, There's you guys lot. rock tens? <gasps> what? Yeah, we got Moonbrion. This is stuff that is just like just coming in. Wow. So none of this is listed yet or anything like that. Yeah, you can you can flip through it, whatever you, whatever you want to flip through. These grades are ridiculous. Ten pristine tens. You got the Zapdos SAR at a 10. Wow, Evolving yeah. Skies, <laughs> That's a good Pristine. Stack right yeah, that is a really good stack. Oh my God, wow, Pristine. <gasps> this is beautiful. We're good at sending in stuff. Charizard, yeah, you guys are definitely, you know what you're doing, <laughs> yeah, man. We, we, we see a lot of cards. Wow, this is wow. The stream room, I mean, this is so much nicer than my own stream room, which is amazing. Product shelf, or just the stream shelf, this is, Dude, this is a crazy setup. <laughs> I appreciate it. Dude. I mean, it's 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 still kind of a work in progress, but uh, it definitely works for now, and uh, we we enjoy it. It's, it's a lot of fun to stream and stuff in here. Yeah. Wow. This is so, oh my gosh, and all the vintage yeah, boxes. Yeah, we got a couple of a couple of them have been opened already. The first day, uh, this was the one that we uh, filmed with in list Leaf. We 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 broke it right here actually. No way. So, yeah, we we did this box break right here. Uh, we got some seal stuff too. We got a first dead jungle box and gem heroes, but um, yeah, some cool stuff. That's so sick. Yo, are you guys selling these ones here? Can I just buy this whole row? <laughs> okay, sweet. Yeah, that'd be. Yeah, tally it up for you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you, and I'm sorry. <laughs> like, okay. Wait. So where else are there things that? It, well, I mean, there's so many walls here. Yeah, I can. So, so this is basically non-Pokemon. If you want to look at that. Well, I mean, this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is this is like the new new stuff, like the stuff that you would see at like Target and Walmart and stuff. You know, that, that kind of stuff. Although you can get it, you know, a good bit cheaper because we don't have to do like MSRP and all that. Kind of stuff. Right. Literally everything should be less than MSRP. Um, Sweet. But yeah, this stuff you can, you know, you'll see it online too. And um, this is just all the all the kind of new modern stuff. We got Pokemon 151 at the very end there. Kind of goes like newest. Oh. <laughs> Oh yeah, you do the 151 ETBs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. And then the oh wait, this guy. I was gonna yeah. grab this guy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me toss this over here too. For sure. Charizard. Wait, you have to touch this though. Oh, that one. Okay. Right, there we go. Cool. Now this one's blessed. <laughs> Sweet. I'm gonna add that to the stack too. Very nice. Beautiful. Okay. And then you said over here is like the the non Pokemon. Yeah. This is the the everything else section. Other than yeah, we we got Pokemon and a couple here, and I think it starts like right here is, is everything else. Oh, cool. What's your favorite on this side? Um, you know. I'm probably crazy for that. I actually have a little bit of a soft spot for Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, I don't know. Something about the vintage like Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. In fact, uh, the, the blue eyes boxes that we just were talking about, uh, that's just a fun set to open. We've opened that up on stream a couple times. And uh, just the nostalgia of that blue eye set is, is nice. So I'd have to say Yu-Gi-Oh. I like these these tins. These are pretty cool. I like the Yu-Gi-Oh tins. Oh, those are sick. Wow. Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh does tins right. So that those are usually pretty cool to collect. Um, 
the Digi I, I like the nostalgia stuff, like Digimon, like classic collection. This was like when they reprinted their the original kind of style Digimon cards. Yeah. Um, didn't do too well, but I like it. <laughs> <laughs> but I like it. Um, Jumpstart is sick for Magic. Jumpstart's like a really cool like uh, way to just have a fun little game. Uh, you take two packs of those and kind of battle them against each other. Yeah. And then that's the whole game. So it's pretty cool. We don't have a ton of Magic and all that kind of stuff, but we do have some customers that uh, like, you know, the other games. Wow, sick. There's so, so much. <laughs> this is cool, man. This is cool. Yeah, man. <laughs> I was just staring at these Yu-Gi-Oh boxes. Yeah, these are like the, the reprints that just came out. Right. The 25th anniversary stuff. Those are really cool. Do you have modern single Pokemon card packs? Yes, I do. Can I have one of each? Nice. This is. Yeah, Japanese and English. Yeah, sweet. It's like my favorite thing to do. Just one of each pack in the entire shop. You get a little mystery box. Speaking of mystery boxes, no, I wanted to hear a little bit about the. the give us the rundown of the PokeClick boxes. Yeah, so uh, our top seller is our VIP box. Um, They're over there, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me, we'll, we'll go see a couple of them over here. So we have kind of our, our, our back storage here of pre made stuff. So we got our VIP boxes. Uh, this one is by far our most uh, top selling one. So you get like a slab in here, you get a premium foil, which is like something, you know, a single, something like that, you know, a tag team, a full art, something like that. Five packs, um, and they just, they sell like hotcakes. Um, as you saw earlier, you know, we, we grade our own stuff, so the slab values are usually pretty solid in these. Uh, that's why people keep buying them over and over. But we got some other stuff too. This one's kind of like a, we call it like a random ETB. There's like nine packs in here, but you can get like a chase pack. So we get stuff like Evolutions and the Hidden Fates. You can get in these. So these are pretty cool. And we got some other, you know, uh, other stuff like this of the Ultimate Collector Box. It's got a bunch more cards in it. Got a bunch of stuff actually. <laughs> a bunch of stuff Oh my in gosh, this one. yeah, what? Yeah, there's a lot of stuff on the back here. It's pretty cool. But um, yeah, props definitely to our designer. He does a great job with these boxes. And then kind of our cheaper option here, a Kickstarter box, kind of for just, you know, people who are starting their collection. Pretty cool though. Wow, sick. Okay, can I? Can I buy one of each? You can, absolutely. <laughs> okay, we're gonna open all of these as well, so stay tuned, because there's a lot of opening to do. <laughs> you know, one of the coolest things about working here is that, you know, we're like an LGS to people that don't have an LGS where they are, a local game store. Um, so, you know, people that have to go to Walmart or Target to buy packs, you know, they don't have the selection and all of that, they can get a Poke Collect custom pack, they can get, you know, one out of every six packs has a hit, all of our packs have hits. Sick, huge. So again, check them out. Their address is on screen right now. If you're in the area, absolutely come by. Um, and even if you're not in the area, it's worth the trip for sure. As you can see, we're definitely making it worth the trip. It's definitely worth the trip. <laughs> yeah, they can vouch. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's on the moon ground. I'm like, well, yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> no, you're, okay. you're good. We Apparently. got some, man. Okay, we have a lot of crazy things, and and you'll be shipping it out to LA. Yeah, we're gonna ship this out to you. Make it, you make it easier. So good. We There's some crazy stuff in the suitcase right now. Uh, check out the other videos. Oh my God. So we don't technically have space for everything, but we're buying everything. And what's the damage? The damage is $1,778 with the Pokemon video. Honestly, I'm in. Okay, let's do it. $1,700 in stuff. Again, check out Pokey Collect online for all of their product and everything that you can get from them. And if you're in the area, come check them out. And we got to go back to LA and open everything up. So... Thank you guys. And we're back in Los Angeles, safely in the studio, an apartment with a big box full of amazing things that we bought at the Pokey Collect warehouse. Let's see what we ended up going home with and we ended, what he ended up sending us to open up on cam, because I know he sent us some cool stuff. If I tip this over, let's see, oh yeah. Oh, there's a lot in there. Oh yeah, okay, let's just take, oh dude, there's so much, bro, let's go. Oh. Let's stack it all up. We'll take all the bubble wrap away too so that it's easier to open up everything. Lovely. And let's see what we got from the homies over at Poke Collect. Okay, starting off with actually these guys, these baggies. And I do, again, I wanna give a huge shout out to Poke Collect. Check out their website. will be linked in the description below. You can buy all these products, including like their mystery packs. Okay, sweet, sweet. Look at this. We've got some Japanese to open up. Um, Cause they did just kind of give us all this product, which is so cool to open here on the channel. So. Um, really, really awesome to see what they built. And again, the reason why this is uh, some Japanese Scarlet Violet EX, the reason why we are over at PokeCollect's warehouse was to buy the craziest collection of vintage Pokemon cards you have ever seen. We got Clayburst right here. If I'm not mistaken, there's 
Marni mm, there's a female trainer, which we didn't pull. Sudowoodo, my boy. So we did end up getting the vintage collection. That video was incredible. And again, if you would like to buy some of the packs that we bought, mysticgrips.com uh, has them, all the insane vintage packs. This is a Pokemon Go right now, Japanese Pokemon Go. Maybe we get that alternate art, or at least a hit of any kind. Charizard, holographic, that's nice. Okay, and a secret rare energy, I think. Actually gonna keep this Charizard for sure, might grade that. All right, and then of course, Japanese 151. This is like the set of the year right now. This guy has been crazy. Let's see what's inside. Come on now. We got the reverse, no master ball, ah, and a Jolteon. Okay, beautiful, that was package number one. Here, you know what, we're gonna open up this one uh, in a second, but I wanted to open up one of these PokeCollect boxes. Yes, because these are the singles. So we, I ended up buying like an entire huge box of single cards. So let's see what we ended up getting. Obviously, oh, these are some full, actually full art shinies from Shining Fates. Obviously, we've got Bolt and V. We got Shiny Falling, Shiny DD. We got the Crobat V Max, Woe Chenny X. Ooh, nice, the four Ortega. Tox, Shiny Tox V Max. And I think this entire stack is pretty much just that. A lot of, yeah. A lot of VMAXs, some Full Art Vs, Full Art Trainers, Jacques, got Rhyme, Urshifu, um, and then maybe there's more Shinies in here, Zamazenta, Shiny Cramorant. Okay, cool, let's keep poking around here. We actually now have, oh, this is so sick. This is the Japanese Mega Pack Bundle Custom Mystery Box here with six Japanese booster packs, one Japanese Special Booster Pack, and then two Japanese Premium Cards. I will say, PokeCollect, they have awesome custom mystery packs over there, uh, which is so sick. Oh, and they have their own like custom tamper-proof tape. What? Okay, I'm gonna have to ask them how they did that because we also, Mystic Rips, are making our own really amazing mystery boxes um, and I wanna do that. So let's uh, <laughs> let's see what we got inside. Okay, some cool things in here. This is the Japanese mystery box, which again, you can buy on PokeCollect's we website, starting off with a pack of Clay Burst. I really wanna give it, yeah, nice, Copper Jaw EX, cool. I was gonna say, I really wanna get it like a big Japanese pull today because we are opening up so much, including Ruler of the Black Flame, which is Japanese Obsidian Flames, which obviously has those Charizards. We'll take a Reverum Art Rare, okay. All right, and then we've got Scarlet and Violet base set. The set's actually pretty expensive. Um, we tried selling it on TikTok and people weren't really interested in it, so. There are great pulls inside though. And then, ooh, okay, now we got some uh, some cooler packs. I think this is Japanese Brilliant Stars, if I'm not mistaken, the Arceus half of it. We got the, okay. And then this right here is Japanese Silver Tempest, which, man, that Lugia V alternate art in Japanese. Man, take a shot every time Mystic7 says Japanese this video, eh? The Lugia V alternate art is just obviously an expensive card from Silver Tempest, but the Japanese version of it is way more expensive. So we could pull that. Nothing today. All right, and then our premium pack will be a V-Star Universe pack. V-Star Universe right now, probably one of my favorites uh, in Japan. Um, just because the God packs in here are amazing. You get a hit in every pack because it's a premium set. This is a really, really cool. And we've got the... Cool, we got the Suian Samurott V. We've got a Secret Rare Water Energy. And then I think that's going to be it for that. Okay, we have two... Premium Japanese cards, with the first one being, nice, okay, we got a Dedenne EX, okay, that's very cool. And then the second one, nice, we have a, uh, what is this, the Dialga, Suyin Dialga, the whatever Dialga V-Star, very cool. Okay, next thing, let's open up another one of these packages. Again, I think it's just kind of like a lot of packs inside. Oh yeah, dude, this is fun. Each one of these little baggies is like a, is like a mystery bag, mystery box. Oh wait, I'm remembering, dude, I, I did this trip and bought these packs like, weeks ago maybe not weeks maybe like two weeks ago so it hasn't been that long but it's been kind of long so i kind of forget what i got out of here Whoa, okay Hisuian and zoroark v star beautiful pull out of that nice so i remember though oh, sweet some silver tempest i remember i think i think i basically just asked them to give me one of every single booster pack they had which is typically what i do when i go out and buy uh, out a bunch of card shops. Radiant Alakazam, very nice. Verizion, just take like one of each loose pack. So if you haven't already hit that subscribe button here on the channel, make sure to subscribe because this is, uh, we do this a lot. You know, travel around, go to different card shops in different states, countries, cities, and pretty much buy them out. All right, Scarlet and Violet right here. This is, I think, Scarlet and Violet base set, I want to say. So this has higher hit rates. Will we see it today? Greebird, nice, the Toad School. Professor. And then the last pack inside of this baggie, we have a Brilliant Stars pack, looking for uh, Senor Charizard, they call him, in the alternate art form. We take a Dusknoir, beautiful card, and a Torterra. Okay, so far, I mean, dude, our haul from the PokeCollect warehouse has been awesome. And then now what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up this Kickstarter box, 
which is really, really cool. We've got two booster packs, two ultra premium or ultra rare cards, one premium foil, and then 20 holographics. This is kind of just like a box for people who are uh, looking to start their collection, which I think is really cool. It's a really cool idea. Kickstarter box, obviously it's in the name. So let's see what we can get out of this guy. Obviously it's got like a lot of like hollows in there. So if you're someone like myself, who's a little bit more seasoned as a collector, um, the hollows are a bit, I mean, they're not worthless, but like I, you know, I probably will be donating these to Goodwill, but this, these packs though, and that premium card, now that's the good stuff. That's what we're here for. So we're starting off with Paldea Evolved. I know for a fact that this set, I think is kind of a sleeper set. There's some really good hits inside of it and it's not super expensive. Spirit Tomb. And then we've also got, ooh, wait, okay. We've got Obsidian Flames. This actually is one of my favorite sets from the Scarlet and Violet era. Um, just because of like the high pull rates and the Charizards, really. It's an exciting set to open up. Yeah. But what is exciting is the premium card. We got a Toxtricity VMAX Shiny from Shining Fates. That's super cool. And, oh, there's like two, I forget, we got two cards in here. We got two cards inside. First one being, oh cool, it's a Full Art Venomoth GX from uh, 2019. So definitely like a rarer card from a rarer set. And we've got a um, Magerna V, it's pretty. All right, all right, dude, these boxes are great. Okay, let's open up, uh, let's open up another one of these pack boxes. I wanna open up more booster packs, so I kinda wanna get these out of the way. Um, and in here, nice, we've got more, oh, this is the Japanese one. Okay, cool. This is probably one of the ones that I'm like most excited. One of these boxes I'm most excited to open up, mainly because I am like addicted to Japanese Pokemon cards and packs right now. So this is, uh, this is like basically the bag of packs that I want to open up. And again, hopefully we get something cool today. Manaphy, Art Rare, nice. And Zamazenta. Again, bro, V-Star Universe, dude, is just like God Pack Central. That set is so strong and this, Ruler of the Black Flame, also absolutely love this set. Beautiful, Nine Tails, art rare, love that. Then we got ourselves a little Paldea Evolved. All right, all right, let's see it. Paldea, give us something amazing. Noivert. And then the lovely Obsidian Flame. Okay, so this isn't just Japanese cards. We've got some English sprinkled in here as well. And nothing. And finishing off with English, Pokemon 151, which is easily my favorite set of the year, the most popular set of the year. This is like the set to be collecting right now. And of course, we'll get a hit or not. Okay. All right, let's go through another one of these singles boxes. Let's see what else we ended up getting. I'm already seeing some like big full arts here, some uh, some Champions Path cards. So nice. Champions Path Dreadnought V. We got the Rabbit Strike Mustard, Drowlodon V Full Art, Volcanion V. We got some more full art trainers, a lot of VMAXs. I like this deck too, because it's got like the full art V. Uh, and these cards are just sick. They're kind of hard to pull too. Dragonite, ooh, Mewtwo V full art, promo card. That's pretty. Or Petko, Shaman, Delphox, Magnezone. This Torkoal card is so sick, bro. What? That looks amazing. Ice QEX, we got full art Rose, Magnezone, Rodom, Lipard, very cool. This is definitely a great stack of cards. Definitely getting all these graded. Okay, let's open up this guy. This is gonna be the mega pack bundle, okay? So inside of here, we're gonna have eight booster packs, one special pack, and two premium foil cards. This is an awesome box here. Obviously, like on the side, look at the detail, dude. There's like lining around the booster packs and around the uh, the text, and it like is like shiny. These are really, really high quality um, mystery boxes when it comes to like packaging and Obviously like the stuff that you find inside, definitely, definitely recommend. Okay, let's see it. And our first stack of booster packs that we got from the box, starting off with Scarlet and Violet. Boom, Coridon EX, another Scarlet and Violet. And nice, the Spidoffs EX full art. Okay, that's actually a great hit. Silver Tempest, oh, Silver Tempest, yeah. And then the next little stack of packs here, which also has our premium cards too. Silver Tempest, whoop, Lost Origin, come on. Brilliant Stars, you Pokemon Go. Please, no. Ooh, and Crown Zenith is our premium pack. This is definitely one of the most fun sets to open up from the Sword and Shield era. Love this, great cards inside and great hits, including the Lapras Art Rare, and we got a Mewtwo Hollow. Okay, and then we've got our premium, our two, I think there's two premium uh, Pokemon cards in side of here, which will be one being the Surfing Pikachu from 25th anniversary. And the second one is an Arbok EX from I think 151. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let's go into this. Uh, we've got, oh God, so much more to open up. We've got ourselves, 
Oh my god, what did I buy, bro? Oh, this is the big one. This is the big one. Okay, obviously starting off with, I mean, like, talk about one of the kings. We were talking about Silver Tempest. Dude, we got a Lugia V alternate art, bro. That's crazy, dude. What a great, great card. Great art. Pretty good quality on that, too. That is, that is freaking beautiful, bro. Wow. Okay, that's strong. And then obviously, okay, so this is, I think, the more premium Pokemon cards we ended up buying. Um, so let's see what else... We had, oh yeah, these are like the premium top loaders. We got the Full Art Serena, okay? So this is an expensive card. We got the Galarian Articuno V. Uh, I think this is the uh, alternate art, right? I forget what set this is from. Crown Zenith, the alternate art. I love this card, absolutely gorgeous. We've got that. We've got the Aerodactyl V alternate art, bro. This is like the craziest mystery bag I've ever opened in my life. <laughs> this is great, okay? We've got that. We've got, oh my god, the Charizard EX SIR from Obsidian Flames, the freaking king. All of these were for sure grading. And then the Alakazam EX from Pokemon 151 SIR as well. And then also to remember that the Moonbrion was also a part of this stack, which I think actually is right here. I got it. It's right here. So remember, we also had the, oh my god. So loud. We also ended up getting the Moonbrion Umbreon V Max as well in this stack too. So the craziest stack of cards I've bought in a very long time. Wow, this is actually ridiculous. This is like basically just like a bunch of top hits from like all of the more modern sets. <laughs> oh my god. So open up another one of these boxes. We've got the Ultimate Collector's box. Oh, we have another one of these. Uh, one in ten chance for a vintage hollow. Okay, that's super cool. Oh my god, there's five textured Pokemon cards, three trainer galleys, two shiny cards, 20 holographic, five booster packs, one premium foil, 10 ultra rare Pokemon cards. This has so much inside of it. This is a really, really great mystery box. So let's see this. The ultimate collector's box. Inside will give us. Oh my god, there's so much. Okay, so our premium cards are in there. We've got the booster packs right here. Let's see what booster packs we got inside. Silver Tempest and Lost Origin. Oh, 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 all right. Enamorous V and Opal. Opal just scares me. Uh, just truth be told, Opal, Opal is just kind of a frightening sight to me, but that's a cool card to pull. We'll definitely take them. Brilliant stars. Come on, Obsidian Flames. Yo. And then the premium pack is another Crown Zenith pack. Again, another really, really fun one to open up. Oh my God, I accidentally pulled the cards into that. That is awesome, dude. One of the biggest hits in the set. We got the Origin Form Palkia V-Star, uh, alternate art, secret illustration rare. I think this is. these are still called alternate arts back in Sword and Shield. Um, that is incredible. Obviously, the, I think the biggest cards are the Arceus and the Dialga or the Giratina. But either way, this is still a huge, huge pull, dude. So freaking super lucky. Wow, we're on fire. Okay, this is like the greatest haul of Pokemon cards I think I've bought in a very, like since Japan, dude. This is nuts. Ah, we went to 8 8 collectibles. We got a bunch of stuff in Vegas too. This has been insane. Okay, so obviously we've got um, a lot of our like holographic and reverse holo cards. Now here are the hits. Here's all of our premium cards. We got Sceptile V, Unknown V, Hisuian Arcanine. We got the Pidgeot. We got Arctivish V, Dodrio. Nice, the uh, Japanese 151 uh, Arcanine EX. We got the Spideops EX, Caracosta from, when is this? 2020, okay. Dialga GX from 2018, definitely more rare. We got our one, two shiny Pokemon cards. So we got the Alakazam. We've got a, oh wow, Rookie D Art Rare, beautiful. Obama Snow, we got Spirit Tomb, so cool. And then we got the Hisuian, Zoroark V-Star, Aerodactyl V-Star, Magnezone, Zeraora, Heatran, and then here we are with our cute little Slowpoke Art Rare. I love this card. Okay, that's fantastic. And now we have a couple of more things to open up. And actually, you know what? Let's open this up right now. This is the Charizard EX uh, Premium Collection box right here. I'm sure you've seen it open up like a million times on YouTube, so. I'm gonna quick rip this. Boom, layer one done. Boom, promo card secured, including the Charizard EX, beautiful. And then we've got our handful of packs, which include Obsidian Flames, bam, probably evolved. Bang, Squawkabilly EX, full art, yeah, 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 yeah. Scarlet Violet, ooh, Mask the, ba the Boss Stiff. Okay, little double hitter, dude. Toxicroak EX, my Boss Stiff art rare, love that. Obsidian Flames, come on, Charizard, please, just one, one pull of you. One pull of you, show me why. We should all buy this set more, shall we? Okay, dude, wait, is this an SAR or SIR? It's got two gold uh, two gold stars. The Rev Room EX, I think this is the SIR version of it, and a huge hit in this set. I don't know if it's really expensive of a card, but it's really, really cool to grab. Okay, Paldia. 
Ooh, we're on fire, bro. Or I guess not on fire because it's water energy. Golden basic water energy, bro. A gold card hit. Scarlet Violet. Ha! Okay, well, we've got one more booster box to open up, which is a Japanese V-Star Universe box. I cannot wait to open that. And then right here, we've got our next and I think last stack of uh, singles. So let's see what was in here. We got some shiny Bolton, shiny Cramorant. Okay, so we got a ton more shiny cards. Uh, from Shiny Star V. We got Rosa. Oh, cool. Rosa Reverse. That's a kind of expensive card compared to the other ones. Heatran. We got White Q-Rim. Oh, this is cool. These are like kind of older cards. More Pekko. We got, oh man, this is sick. Kind of like an OG Reverse Scizor. Iron Treads. Houndstone. Okay, so then it's just a lot of EXs. Uh, we got Vs. This is all from kind of like recent sets. Piers, Kabu, Bolton, Starmie, Bead, Ice Q. Okay, sweet. Talks, yeah, nice. Just a good grab of rare, rare cards and hits. All right, and now we've got one of my favorite things that we're gonna open up right now, the V-Star Japanese V-Star Universe booster box, which again, this box is like cracked. Um, these, there's just insane, insane hits that you get inside of these, including God Packs, which we have pulled, I mean, like nonstop over on TikTok. We do uh, daily live breaks on TikTok on our Mystic Rips account. So check us out if you wanna come buy some packs and, and rip them live or just buy them and keep them. Also too, like right now it's Black Friday and the TikTok deals are like insane. Nice, we got the V-Star, got the Mew, and then some other hollows. So we are uh, we are ripping so much Japanese V-Star and have been over on TikTok. Super popular set. And you're hopefully about to see why Galarian Moltres V Okay, got the Irida. All right, next pack. Please give us, dude. <laughs> we pull a god pack today, bro. I will freak out. The V Star. Okay, okay. And again, big thank you over to Poke Collect for just kind of supplying all this for us. Like super homey move. Check out their website. Uh, link is in the description. And nice stun sparse. Oh my god, we freaking did it. The alternate art Charizard V Star. This is the S A R right there in the bottom left, as you can see. S A R. I know this is a promo card in English, but in Japanese, you have to pull it, and it is not easy to pull. So there we go. One of the biggest hits in the entire set. Charizard S A R. <laughs> Let's freaking get it. Oh my god, bro. This is crazy. <laughs> hey, and listen, if you're enjoying the video and you've had a lot of fun here, make sure to subscribe. We're on our way to 200,000 subscribers. Nice. We got the lap. We got the Leafy on V. We actually just recently broke 100,000 subs and we're already past 115K. So huge thank you to everybody who's joining our community, subscribing, be a part of the, the mission to drive the journey because we've got so many amazing videos and amazing things and products and all this kind of cool stuff coming up very, very soon here. So again, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of it. We got the Palkia V-Star and help us grab that 200,000 subscriber uh, uh, flex, I guess. All right, what else do we have in this box? Nice, Electrovire, Suyin Samurai V. Now we already pulled an SAR. I don't know if you pull two in a box or, I mean, technically we could always get a God Pack and that would just be nuts. We got the V-Star there. Oh, this is a secret rare, nice. But the coolest part about Japanese uh, V-Star Universe is the fact that since it's like a special holiday set, you get a hit in every single pack pretty much. So it's just really fun to open. But last pack here, thank you again to Poke Collect. Thank you for watching, but Champ V, We've got the Galarian Articuno. Oh, let's go. And we score a shiny Radiant Charizard in the last pack, bro. That is beautiful. That is amazing. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next episode.